peeps what's up this is Puck today we're gonna install Android 5.0 um, on a tablet we're gonna do that on a x86 tablet for those that don't know what's a x86 tablet well a x86 tablet is a tablet that can also run Windows and here I'm gonna show it to you we will boot it up let me turn it on so there she goes and as a matter of fact this thing is running Windows 10 at this moment this is a Windows 10 tablet as you can see it, it's really amazing it runs Windows 10 fantastic Here you can see Windows 10 nice huh? <laughs> but uh, we're gonna kill the baby so I'm just gonna turn it off dang so I just killed the baby and what we're gonna do we're gonna install Android 5 Lollipop on this baby here so how are we gonna do it well what we're gonna do in fact is uh, first we got to repartition this drive because we must create a Linux drive to do that uh, as you could see in my previous video we will use a program called Gparted and here is Gparted and we will have to do certain things so come see and uh, well let's do it together so what we're gonna do now we're gonna boot the baby and we oh it wasn't off see that one two three four five six seven eight nine bam now it's off I'm gonna turn it on hit f11 or f12 one of these shoot f11 now i can select the boot device and i will start off from lexer let me zoom in a little bit for you guys there I'm low on battery so I hope we're gonna fix we will be able to okay we're gonna install or run G part of default settings gonna boot it up and in fact this will also uh, find the touch screen etc so everything will just be touchable but what we need to do is to delete this hard drive and create um, a Linux drive. And this is a complete Linux desktop. It's running straight from the USB. You will see it flashing there. And soon the desktop will load. And then, there you go. Just uh, corrected the screen settings. And the link for this uh, ISO file you can find in my previous video, the one talking about how to create a bootable drive. Okay, um, don't select key map, just, just hit next. Uh, 33 is English, just hit next. Which mode do you prefer? Uh, continue to start X, continue. And now the desktop will start up. So you, this is mandatory to do because you need uh, to create a Linus drive. So, okay, now you can see it a little bit here on top. You will see several things. Invalid partition, just say ignore here. Um, here on top, let me get this. We will say um, uh, this partitions here, the 14 gigabyte, we will say resize, remove, delete. We hit delete there, you see that? and this is the 16 gigabyte drive we will leave that that is our drive we cannot delete that and we delete this one and then we say apply and then we say apply all operations successfully done and then we say ignore and then here we're gonna say new uh, we select this drive and then gparted or edit uh, 
uh, few um, new and then up here we will select to create a Linux partition X3 I hope you can see it X3 and then we say at so it just created uh, the partition and then we say apply apply and now it will create the partitions and we will get this uh, fixed for uh, for Android uh, I had Windows 10 installed on this so we're killing a good working Windows 10 uh, yeah tablet just call it this way and uh, well at this moment it's creating the partition when this is done I'll get back to you everything went right you will see this and then you can say close and then just uh, ignore and then gpart it here on top and then quit and then exit you could not see that but the bottoms here on top I just hit that exit here exit and now it's exiting it takes a little to uh, exit here you go and then we say shut down as you can see it's fully touch screen so we're just gonna shut it down up here we have our Android stick we're gonna stick that one in now we're gonna turn on again we're gonna hit F11 on this on this keyboard so it will tell the bias to boot from the Android drive so here you can see uh, install Android we will go to uh, install installation the last one let me put it a little closer for you there there we go and this will go real fast I think we will make it with the battery and then up here we will say uh, create modify partitions and then we will say uh, you have SDA and SBDJ uh, let me see something hard disk so we're gonna fatal bad error okay retry and then um, yeah we'll just hit uh, SDA1 and then we say format to X3 and then we say yes format in the drive now if everyone knows what this sound is let me know do you want to install system directory as read write? Say yes. Tell me when will you be mine? Tell me quando, quando, quando. Da, da, di, da, 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 da. So, and now we can say uh, reboot. I would go for reboot. Then you can see if everything went right. You hit reboot. Then you remove the stick. And now it should boot to the Android. To the Android thingy straight from hard drive you see that and now we can run I hope you can see it let me show it a little bit closer it will automatically start in, in fact now we're starting Android 5 this is lollipop 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 you're my little little lollipop lollipop you see and they did something uh, with the you know I also really wanted to see that in Windows 10 you know like a change because Windows 10 boots just like Windows 8 not that it's bad it's beautiful but you know a little change you know 
I like this. I like the boot screen. Oh, look at that. La 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 la. Okay, we hit okay here. Welcome, make yourself at home. But my touch screen is not working. Lollipop, lollipop. You're my little, little lollipop, lollipop. My keyboard works. So I think, my dear friends, that this is. Why is my bloody touch screen not working? Well, in fact, <laughs> I will call this video how to install Android on a, on a PC or laptop. So this is the laptop version because what we need now need to do, of course, is to, you know, um, let's see if I can get with tab. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yay! So this is how it looks, but my touch screen uh, doesn't work. I don't know why, because probably this is the alpha version. This is, yeah, yeah, this is the alpha version. So, you know, uh, my touch screen doesn't work yet, but this is how it looks. And uh, let me see if with tap I can get into, yep. There we go. Customize your blah, 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 blah. Cool. Oops, I didn't want to do that. Oops. With tap, I will go. Let's go to settings and let me show it to you. Oh, look at the settings, they look all nice, and eh? don't you think it looks nice? It looks really nice. And here we can go to about this laptop. I will have to end this video because my battery is getting empty. About this tablet, and here you can see it it's an unknown Android tablet, but this is Android version 5 called the lollipop and that's how to install it on <laughs> any <laughs> laptop well uh, I cannot say uh, any laptop or any tablet because this is the first very first time that uh, my tablet touchscreen is not working so you know this will be like a mini PC a mini tablet not that I'm gonna keep it I just wanted to show it to you guys how to install it and how to create a bootable disk a USB stick from the thing but as you can see it's running uh, very nice and uh, I did not see if we had um, if we had the Play Store so let me take a look because many of you will be really happy to see the play store but uh friends uh i can tell you at this time there is no play store yet installed but of course if you want to uh yeah download apps just go make sure that oh let's see if the wi-fi is working because then you just go to the internet and then you go get uh and now we turn the wi-fi on yay it's on so as you can see uh, this also works only thing I don't have touch screen so but I don't really care about that cause you know um, yeah <laughs> so that's it and um, yeah I do uh, have a keyboard etc so we have Wi-Fi so you can go to the internet and just uh, go get yourself uh, yeah one mobile market and you know install apps and you know make the thing the way you want it and uh, try out apps try out everything and test it with us this is the alpha version uh, don't uh, don't start uh, crying if certain apps don't work you know shouldn't think that everything worked this is an alpha version and i want to say thank you to the developers that put this online for us x86 uh, testers thank you very much uh, thank you for um, creating the iso file um, good luck with uh, the continuing of this work and i say good luck installing um, lollipop on your tablet or probably laptop so I'm also going to try to see if this uh, can be installed on some Acer laptop that I have lying around, you know, and uh, I will let you know in my next video. Anyway, thanks for watching, peeps. I think this was a real amazing uh, little project and I really enjoyed making this video. So if you like it, uh, please uh, don't forget to hit the like button. Of course, subscribe to my channel and be one of my 4000 subscribers. Bye bye.